Hello again, we are back to No Man's Sky after an extremely, extremely intense week of Starfield. As some may know, I've been playing this game a lot, and as some perhaps not know, uh, well, I've been playing Starfield as well. And I will be uploading, you know, your good old six hour streams. Now, today we will be creating a new game as usual. Actually, as the opposite of usual. So, I will be finishing the expedition. Like, that is literally the focus here. And that's pretty much it. So, right now, I just need to go to No Man's Sky that Axie. And, unfortunately, get rid of that beautiful image of Samara. With the dead people. And, uh, here we go. Expedition start. So, uh, I haven't played this game for a week. I have to say, it feels like a damned eternity since I was back to No Man's Sky. I think I just fell in love with Starfield. What, what do I have to say? Is it the same game? Is it a different kind of game? Oh, it's a... It's complicated. It is a very similar game. Almost the same. And at the same time, it is completely different. In No Man's Sky, the world has so many things. Every single world has so many t things in it. Everything. In Starfield, most of the worlds are just fucking dead. There's nothing. There's the two or three events. They act like, like dungeon hubs, if anything, and you just select the gun dungeon and go. Here, I don't know, here everything is filled. The, the NPC interaction in this game is pretty much fucking dead. And in Starfield, NPC interaction exists. So, as you can see, they are the same in a certain sense. And they are different than another. So, oh my gosh, a gag? Really now? I'm a small bird rat mix. Bird rat slug mix, I mean. Oh my gosh. The movement is so smooth and different. <sighs> Freedom. I still feel bad about New Game Plus and Starfield. I let go of so much content that I of a build I had of a world I had built, of relationships I have created, of love that did not fulfill itself. And here it reminds me because I have you know this is like, I had a 100% run, I still have it, and we'll go back to it, but... Here I'm... Back to almost zero, you know? Almost. Uh, what the heck is this shit? It's I have a little bit of lag. We'll keep that in mind. I have a... Lame ship. Oh. It might be land on the freighter, lost in space. I'm, I'm. Oh, would you look at that? Okay, I can do alchemy. What resources do we have? What things do we have back here? Oh, some carbon. I better start by gathering that. It's the easiest and fastest source of carbon you're gonna get. If I get the angle to grab it. I let go of so much. Alright. This should be enough carbon to keep me going for a while, to be honest. That is a lot of carbon. Oh, yeah. The difficulty. Yeah, I'm not going to bother increasing the difficulty here. This is my, my quest here is to finish the... Oh, what is this? Oh, hold on. Phase one. Really now? What? 
I like this, this symbol. The symbol is pretty. Log. Huh, why is this here? Hold on, on the expedition, does it say? No, it doesn't. It's not required. It's just there for some reason. I don't need it. Milestones. Okay, so I need to plan out my route now. Easy. Um, yeah, I need loading memory files. Loading make money. Yes. I need to make money. This should come by easily. Recipes. What recipes do I have? Planets nearby. Creature pellets available. Adopt two companions. Companion slots? Companion slots available. Uh, press X. Companion register. Two slots available. Good. Uh, progress report. Problem solved. Problem solved. Problem solved. Where is this? Good. Move. Yeah, I I have only pl not played for one week. It feels like so much longer. It feels way longer. I I I feel like I have not been here for so long. I can see a lot of people are already here. Whereas I am happy to see that. Oh my gosh, this thing turns like a snail. Holy crap. Dissonance. The sentinel ships. Sentinel. Sentinels call to me. Press pulse. Yeah, that's right. There's a seamless experience here. Oh, it's not just that. It's also that I'm playing in a smaller screen because of my new. I see. Okay. Huh. It's inspiring to be back here. The save beacon has something for me. The save beacon is fucking useless. Yes, hold on multi-tool. I don't have advanced mining. That's an issue. Um, how do I get to that objective? Rendezvous 1. Oh! A specific journey may be required to reach a rendezvous. Oh, okay. So that's useless. Huh. I know some things already. Um. I don't know. I feel confused. What do I do next? Gather resources. I need to make money. For that I need nanites. For that I need resources. Gotcha. All of my money making loops are not available right now. Alright, hold on. 
Oh, that takes a while. Animals. Slowly retreat to the shadows. And adopt. Um, great. This will come in handy. I am in a rush. Of course I'm in a rush. Do you think I live forever? And even if I could come back, I couldn't bring my memories with me. Plant the DM. Might come in handy. Alright. Good, good. Ah, yes. I remember now. The first of the starting loops. Um, what kind of system am I in? Log, catalog, discoveries. This is a GEC system. Alright, good, good, good. So far, so good. What's a weird switch? How many gas does my ship have? Enough. Oh, I hadn't seen one of those in quite a while. Yeah, I need to... to get petted. Seem angry. Good. Second creature. You collect milk and adopt. Good. Advanced mining laser required. Okay. I need to find an outpost of some sort. That's true. And iron. What? Tired? They offer my hand. I accept the knowledge. Yeah. Good. Gek work for Gek, but aren't I already Gek? Huh. There we go. That's what I need. I need carbon, a lot of it. Yeah, chromatic metal. I need chromatic metal. Alright. This is a peaceful enough planet to begin in. Great. Great. Nice.
Oh yeah, this will eventually come into play. Good, good, good. Just scan everything. And I'll need to visit another system. Several, probably. Oh, I can't analyze myself. I can't analyze this good. Pet him. Give pellets. Good. Incompatible size. But I'm... We're the same size, brother. Well, whatever. Lies have been said. I am not of its same size, apparently. You look at that. Nice. Huh. All right, pet. All right, pet, you have to go away because you interfere with my duties. Oops. Creatures, dismiss. Goodbye. Good. Got him. Huh. gonna get nanites I can get some nanites from this but I don't need it from this I need a better ship and for that I need a good mining laser ah there's an animal good good Get the oxygen. Good. A little bit more O2, just in case me. I do, in fact, need to build a base. Tino ball. I don't I really don't need it. Don't mind me, just mining and exploring a little bit. I need access. Access. What do I mean by access? But it is true, I do indeed need access. What do I refer to by access? Um, in several games, there's something that I call breaking the game, which is just within the rules of the game. No glitches, no bugs, no exploits. Just getting over the economy systems all right and that's what I'm trying to do now to do that I'm gonna need several resources and to get to those resources it's not gonna be simple it's never that simple of a task. I'm 
But what can I say? I'll eventually get there and you'll see what I mean. I just need... Sigil group is useless. Ha ha ha! That's a nice find right there. So once I have access, I should be able to progress the story very easily. Oh, actually I need to find several creatures, not just one. Or two. Several, many of them. This looks like a swallow. I, as a finch myself, do not enjoy swallows. Good, more buried technology modules. This will come very handy. Soon enough. But for the moment, we're just gonna need some more hydrogen. For a lot of stuff, let me tell you, a lot of stuff need hydrogen. that no already already have that all I need is a little bit oh boy oh easy just get the next drop next cargo drop keep it coming where is it really no tech module close to this. That's no. Alright. Gotta get to that one. Okay. Well, we are doing it, certainly. Woo! I would say I need to get better at my early game, but what am I talking about? I already found the very pretty planet to land in and to spend. So, ha ha ha! Would you look at that, huh? To spend some time in. Oh, dead. I'm dead? It actually bucked me up. It just saw me, it didn't, it didn't think. It just killed me. Holy shit. And No Man's Sky crashed. Absolutely fucking amazing. Alright, send me back. It literally kicked me out of the game. That, that, that. Beautiful. Give me a second. I gotta turn on my light. So, funny thing is... Um... Oof. If this was, uh, funny, <laughs> if that was the 100%, I mean, not the 100%, if that was a permadeath run, that would have been it. It's like, oh boy, time to restart. But that's fine. It's my, it's, uh, shit happens, you know. And I also wasn't expecting to get fucking two shot. Like, I really wasn't expecting that. Oh, it actually saved right before I got killed. Alright, let's go to the exact same spot. With no extra preparations. To show my spite over that fucking creature. I'm obviously not gonna change absolutely anything. All I have now is the knowledge that it's an asshole. And now, I'll kill it on sight.
because I was trying to scan it, but now I see that it was a mistake to scan it. Oh man, ferrite dust is tough not to crack, huh? There's a place. Where is that asshole? I don't see it on this side. Oh my gosh, I hate the camera in this game. It's just uncomfortably too low. It needs a little bit of an upper perspective so that you don't aren't interrupted by the grass. Where is it? Did I want too low? Did I go too low? Maybe it's gonna appear soon. Better stay on my toes. Is it that one? Why am I lagging? Is, is there something wrong with my with my quality right now? No? What the heck? Why the fuck do I have lag? There's that fucking asshole. Time to die, asshole. Bastard. Ow. already forgotten sodium and already forgetting that this this game's strongest point is not stability all right should be good enough Three. Good. I don't see any more enemies. Good. So, how do I get nanites early on? Please, game, stop lagging. I don't know why it's, it's really unstable today. Oh, it's probably because I'm in a multiplayer section with a lot of people. Yeah. That's the reason. Alright, hello, good sir. Advanced mining laser for 75. Good. Everything else I can let go. This is the one. All right, good to know.
Print chart, sure. Good. Now we can go do things. What do you have for sale? Hmm. Microprocessor, Starship Fuel, Cobalt. Ah, oh, yes, I almost forget. Hello? An ancient ruined site? How unfortunate. Friend. Nope. Request dialect like help. Uh, trade symbol. Trade. Dialect help. Trade. And then talk. Uh, trading. Good. Decline. No more Gex here. Just two. On the sad end, rather, of outposts. Uh, maybe I should go to that site. Uh, where is that? Three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, one. Planetary. All right. ship it's gonna cost a lot of fuel but it's okay it's actually okay all right go to the ancient site how far away is it minutes I'll have to go to outer space man this ship sucks discovered by hello games that's funny huh and just in the meantime oh no it's a hyperdrive one Uh, what do I need this for? Go this way.
Come on. Where is it? Where is you? Well, there's one here, I guess. Oh, no, not again. Can't see any. It's literally right there. Excuse me, look up. Wow, this temple was quite large. It's right there. There we go. An underwater temple, huh? Please fly up. Thank you. There must be one more. Playing other games has made me absolutely intolerable of this camera. It reminds me of Metal Gear Solid 2 cameras, where they would just be in the most shitty of spots. They made improvements in Metal Gear Solid 3. Really? Nice. All right, hold on. Discoveries. Sixty eight nanites, huh? Well, at least the fuel is sort of efficient. Oh, yeah. I should put this here. Like, big time. Something here. Unknown building. It's just trash, unfortunately. I was thinking, oh, maybe I should get head back. And then the truth hit me. Head back where? What do you mean? It's not like you had a map or anything. 11th expedition, what? There's a lot of stuff and none that I need. Please tell me it's not trash again. It is trash. Or is there... Oh, one of these things actually, actually useful. Fortunate, unfortunately spending um, gas. At least the planet is safe. Relatively speaking, of course. Okay, this should help a little. Minor settlement. Good, good, good. Oh, cobalt. 
It's perfect. Okay, good, good, good. But I don't have any shields like to take on um Sentinels. Even though I would enjoy the fight. The Cobalt should be good for batteries later on. Good. Is the Nexus available here? That's a very important question. Because if I can catalyze myself to a car, that'd be something else. Good, good. Alright, this should be good enough. And a little bit of Myro Volts, you never know when they might come in handy. Oh man. Soon as I get that laser, and uh, what else? Huh, and I need chromatic metal too. Holy crap! Oh, the minor settlement happens to be quite far. can't just go around the universe in a ship that sucks. Huh. Well, this game is beautiful. do we have here? Let us see. Oh, it is a true minor settlement. Nice. A little bit of sodium here and there. Great. Hello. Hello, technology merchant. What do you have? Expensive stuff. Nothing of this is worth selling. But what can you tell me about? Blueprints you have. Yeah, this is the one. Good. Huh. Oh, there should be another guy in here, really. 
Here you are. Hello, Mr. Assistant. Huh. Tap the pat. Okay. That was rude. Takes pity on me because I'm dumb, apparently. Oh! Alright. A little bit of encrypted data. Hmm, nothing else. Unfortunate. Wait, hold on. Where is the... Where is the spike that marks the site? It's literally missing. I'm actually sort of stranded. Another one of these, great. Now, how the heck do I get a wiring loom? Oh, I think I know how. I'm gonna need several distress signals. Anything here for me? Nope. Am I getting navigational data to do that? I'm not, huh? Feels like shit. <sighs> Whoa, hold on a second. That could be a big win for me. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have gone out so hastily. I got some starship fuel, alright. Let's see if I get lucky. An inverted mirror. Unfortunate, but still necessary. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, zero. Great. Unfortunate. Jettison pot, huh? What is in this? Oh, and some ferrite, which I haven't obtained. Not nearly enough. What? What the heck was that? Damage container. Starship. Viking dagger. That might come in handy eventually. I need to find ancient alien structures. Or find an echo locator. And 
that would be my little gold mine. So we got options, not too many, but some. Oof. My gosh. They overdid it with the with these things. Sending me a bit too far, huh? have to admit, I learned to enjoy this game on an advanced level. I don't find anything romantic about starting over. There's nothing, it's just a struggle. I don't find anything in this kind of struggle. Save points, save beacon, portable refiner, signal booster. No computer? No base computer? But isn't one of the requirements to... To establish a base? Standing increase with the outlaws? How? But what did I do? Shield module, that's kind of cool. Alright, let's move a little bit more. What is that? Is that a... yeah, that's a recharger. There you are. More solid data, just two. Two is fine. One is not fine, two is actually fine. Navigational data. Nice. And you might... Yeah, I don't need that. What do you think about a little... Hmm... This. Alright. I have units now. Enough to buy the wiring looms, right? Two. Wow, they are... V what? Wiring loom for... Holy crap, that's nothing. Uh, sent back to Starship. All to Starship. I have very little of that. Actually, no. Good. Mining laser found. Ah, oh, there's a thing. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. There you are. Why is it so lagging you, these guys? Uh, 
I'll have some carbon. Uh, okay. Trying to find... Some of those guys, but I don't see any. Huh, curious. More money. Even though these things, I'll admit, they drive me absolutely insane. Well, not if it's that easy. Alright, let's just move. Great. Fantastic! This was a lot better than last one. And large artifact crate. Good. Got lucky, paid attention. We're on our way to our first million. Near a toxic. Oh. Dissonance Resonator. Good, good, good. Everything's going according to plan now. Finally. I still see no reason to live the, leave this planet. What would it take for this goddamn chromatic metal, huh? Yeah, it's gonna take a while. Good, good. And between the carbon and the condensed carbon, we should be good. Oh yeah, I almost forget. Network, low PVP with no one. I just remembered that. Why disable PVP? Because there are some high level people that are very, very angry. At who? I don't know. Probably their mom didn't treat them properly or something. But let me tell you, they're very angry. Good, sir. Alright, this is perfect moment to get some more of this. Great. A lot of Atlantidium. Finally, radiant charts. Which will prove the future of this little enterprise of mine. Come on. Tell me it's dying. God damn, I got lucky. Good. Now it's time to run. Five, four, 
two, one. Oh yeah, I got lucky, all right. Oh, hello. Could use some Pognium. Wait, do you already have the... Oh man, that's nice. Star Bramble, I can't collect it because of that. That's fine. Oh, here you are. Good, 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 good. Good, nice, because it says walk, so. Almost there. All boom and pearls, got to be careful with those. Those get the, the sentinels real riled up. I think I'm only missing iron, but I should be good on everything else. At least for the basics. How much is this worth, by the way? Uh, 124k, not much. All right, now time to go to space and it's almost time to get rid of this piece of shit. I need a base computer quickly now. Wait, no base computer? How am I supposed to make a base without a base computer? Right? Am I crazy to think that? Think more. Yes. I need to think. I'm avoiding something in the back of my mind. I can't quite add it. I can't quite say what. But I am. What could it be? Where's the catalog? Technology? No. Building parts? Yeah, base computer, look at that! How do I build a base without a base computer? Wait. Why did I get increasing standing with the outlaws? A a a a a Corbex. Hello. Um. None of this is good for me. I'm gonna deactivate multiplayer if, if my standing continues to be decreased for no reason. 
Okay, that's it. Somebody sabotaging everybody. That dude's just sabotaging everyone. That's not acceptable. Emergency data. Secure site of interest. Alien cartographic data? No, I don't need this anymore. I'll think about it. Hello, scout. Dialect like help. A Viking. Analyst. Dialect help. Oh, I can't practice my la language with them. That's interesting. What about you? Yes, I can. Quest dialect help. Uh, trade symbol. All right, practice language skills. Let's see what you got. I'll get gives. Unfortunate, another trash. Wait, I already visited you? When? I just got here. I, I, how am I still gaining pirate? I deactivated multiplayer. How am I still gaining pirate stats? Why? This place is cursed. All right, technological. Some nanites, generous amount. Low, but generous. Inventory expansion, always useful. What? Yeah. Great. That's that. Now, how in the hell am I gonna get a base computer? Do I need to get it from the t tech merchants? I hate turning off multiplayer for sabotage reasons, to be honest. Units. Hmm. Disappointing. still hmm so where the heck do I get a base computer from it's a blueprint that I could learn potentially from abandoned structures maybe sounds about right unknown building again uh, let's see if it's not trash why am I getting standing with the outlaws for no reason? Bro. 
I'm gonna have to use a passport once I get with the outlaws. side of the universe. Also, I should install this here. Wait, I don't have a hyperdrive module? Seriously, I don't. What the heck? Oh, this is actually mine? I'm actually very okay with that. So how the frick do I get a base computer? Oh, here you go. So I need to go to a new system. Oh, okay. And how do I go to a new system without the technology to go to, to jump to a new system? Supreme movement upgrade. Oh, you have to click it. Oh, so that's how progress comes in this. Oh, okay. Weird. Oh, boy. So you're really rewarded for following the, the, the test. All right. Interesting. Ah, oh, so that's how expeditions work, huh? Holy crap. this is starting to make sense oh but I need to install this holy shit look at that chromatic metal that's too much chromatic metal but now I see now it's starting to make sense. I see that I'm in a bit of a paradox, huh? But maybe not so much. I can try something weird and interesting I have an idea because I need to circumvent the hyperdrive 250 chromatic metal is just not acceptable it's too much alright good good I'm thinking now I'm thinking Right, hello you. I need components. Huh. I might need these. And I might need these. 
I might need these. I might need this. Alright. I'm not gonna be missing that. Uh, switch inventory. There we go. Then sell this. Sell this. Sell this. Because they suck. And here, sell this. Sell that. Alright, good. Almost there. One navigational data, fantastic. Uh, carbon. Nice. Oh, actually, bef just before that, just before that, I need to save point. Sodium nitrate and metal plating. Metal plating. I need three metal platings. Or just, yeah, I need three. All right. Send this to ship. Ship and ship. Then here I need good three metal plating. Because I need a refiner. And with the refiner, with a little bit of carbon, I can do sodium into sodium nitrate. And in the meantime, I can collect a little bit more of this. Nice. Okay, now we're moving. Now I feel the progress. Good, radiant chart. Good, good, good. Nice, 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 nice. Good maneuver, good maneuver. Nice. And then I go get that. I need some oxygen. And we're schmoovin'. Oh yeah, we're moving now. Okay, where is it? Here we go. Nanites for the win. And we have more of these. Who knows what I'll need them for. And I'm not gonna be lacking them by the time I need them, let me tell ya. Right, sodium nitrate goes back to the suit. Oh yeah. Um, so yeah. 
get me some carbon. And now, nice, I can make the safe beacon easily. So now all I need to do is to call the thing and we should be good. What thing? The echolocator. This is going to be a very interesting maneuver, let me tell you. Very, very interesting. Good, good. Alright, that's enough carbon for now. Now, having said all of this, it's a good moment to check the all the glitters. Nice. Atlas Pass it. Really? Atlas Pass V1, nice. Optical drill. Oh man, that's looking, starting to look good, like real good. Uh, no, thank you. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm circumventing that one because I don't feel like struggling in this ship. Build a what? Huh. Storm crystals. So just scan. Viking words and scan. Vortex cubes, these are weird to come by. Oh crap. Mine from asteroids. This is actually really easy to get. Huh. This is gonna be complicated. Now, good. Now we're circumventing everything that we're supposed to do. Oh, it's right there. Fine, fine by me. Come on. Come on. There we go. Good. Nice. All right, this should be easy enough. And this should get, get me options. The most important part of everything is having options. Essentially, I'm just going to need to visit different worlds. Hmm. A lot of different worlds. So mobility upgrades are great. But it, it doesn't really matter. I, 
whether I'm hunting or not for a specific objective, I need to go to a lot of worlds. Well, it is called an expedition for a mission for a reason, right? Damn it. I overheated it. in here is already scanned for him. great good so now now we'll see nice suspicious goods nice damn it where's my ship Um, send this back, send this back, open this up, send this back. No, nothing. Good. Good. Nice. Okay, that frees me up a little bit. Tainted metal, ooh. Multi-tool expansion, huh? That's actually quite nice. Uh-oh. Scan. One six twelve Harmony One Six Twelve Nice Let's lock down Deactivate Harmonic seal, accord, and locate dissonance spikes. Beautiful. And as usual, I do it again. <laughs> Sentinel ships forever, baby. A class multi tool, no way. Take it for free. And then I can get rid of this piece of shit. Stormy. 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 Right, so multi tool, this one. Give me some space, thank you. Crystallized heart, where the heck am I gonna get that? Right, that should be more than enough for the moment, well, except for this one. Easy, easy, easy. I don't have any inverted mirror. They're in the ship. They're in the ship. And the bolt caster. Good moment to show up. Optical drill package. Extractor. Terrain manipulator. This one can go here. Advanced mining laser. Scanner. Analysis visor can go there. And charge you up. Good. Nice. 
So now where's the dissonance spike? I hope I don't need any crystallized hearts to unlock them. Oh, would you look at that? Two here. So close by. Do I have inverted mirrors here with me at the moment? I think I do. Yes, I have one. That should be good enough. Oh, I almost made a mistake. Oh, crap. Gosh, I almost make a grave mistake. Holy shit. That was so close. Save beacon. Should be the only one with yeah there we go beautiful there's no reason to call my frigate anywhere absolutely no reason at all come on Wow, it's quite far, I must admit. All right, 17 seconds, we're almost there. Come on. It's taking absolutely forever. Also, remember, this is a peaceful planet. If it wasn't, getting to this point would have been a much greater pain in the ass. And to that I say, I knew what I was doing. I knew what I was looking for. Nice. This one is actually not that bad. I wouldn't add it to my collection on the other account, but it's not bad at all. 10 walker brains god damn cool oh my gosh it's an a-class ship it's a goddamn my first ship here is an a-class all right baby now we're talking. All right. Good, good, good. How far away is it? It's close. Huh. Nice. Oh, right by one of these. forgot throw that shit away some nanites
Cool. 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 There we go. Nice. Feeling this piece of shit. Can't wait to scrap it, I gotta say. I mean, it's it's a C tier, man. What else how else can you judge it? Obviously, by context and comparison. It's the only way you can judge things. Context and comparison. Why do we know that certain technology is shit and other is good? Because you compare them. If you if there was all, if these were the only intergalactic spaceships that had existed, well, you're talking about top of the line. But this is the like the bare minimum. Oh boy. Blame this. Nice. Now, time to move. Send everything to the freighter. That's mine. Uh, yeah, sure. Repair kits, sure, 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 and more died. Uh, no, thank you, more died. Sentinel weapon shard. Oh, that's great. So I have one more slot. Yeah, you can go in there. I don't need to. And we'll talk about selling stuff in a minute. I'm very, very interested in scrapping this. Great. Oh, what's this? Okay, and now what I need to do for you, Mr. Cartographer, is buy charts. Oh. Um, so what? Let's see. Sell this. Not gonna need tainted metal. Sweet root, not gonna need it. Milk, not gonna need it. Proto sausage, not gonna need it. Impulse beans, not gonna need them. Good. No, buy. There's nothing. Copper. Big time important. Now from my freighter. Hmm. Free this spot. Uh. 
Oh yeah, I need to sell those. Nice. Wow, solar sails on that thing? That's kind of cool. Getting thirsty over here, huh? Uh, claim starship. Claim. Goodbye, piece of shit. I'll not miss you. The first ship in the game, I'm sentimental about it. But this one? For starting an expedition? Oh, I scoff at you, good sir. Scoff, scoff. Good, 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 good. Subatomic. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's expensive. Nano cables. Oh, that ship, that ship is cool. I don't know. From the front, not that much, but sideways is kind of cool. Good. We're back. Oh, and I can see. Woo. What a ship, brother. What a, ooh, it's filled to the brim with the good stuff. Oh, I think I forgot to remove something from my other ship. An upgrade or two. Well. Too bad, I guess. Too freaking bad. No, not this one. It has to be this one. And then just... Oh, Atlas Pass. All right. Good, 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 good. Nice. Cool. And this should give me the other expedition thing. <laughs> okay. From back from the back, this ship is cool. I, I like its design from the back. Alright, log, expedition, phase one. Prepackaged reporter to left see we're good. God damn, what a status change, you know? I was uh, from a C class dog shit ship to a. Bro, that ship is kinda cool. Where is Rendezvous 1? Over here. Oh, and I need to mine asteroids now that I think about it. Quite many of them. So I better keep my eyes peeled. 
Activated copper, that means that this place has thunderstorms, extreme climate. I better be careful. I have no environmental protection yet. What the heck was that? this temperature nice oh what the heck was that what the what what Park it down there. All right. Good. Keep it steady. Keep it steady. Nice. Extreme heat storm on a cold planet. Reach the first rendezvous point. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, what's the reward? Upgrade me, upgrade me, upgrade me. Nice. Oh, I'm definitely gonna use that storage augmentation. I'll, need, I'll be taking those. Minus 31% demand, huh? That's quite a profit margin, huh? What do we have here? Blueprints. Rank three required, unfortunate. What are you selling? Cobalt metal plating. Yeah, that way I never need that. And that way I never need that. Good. There are several things that I'll never need now. All right, send this to my ship, send this to my ship, to ship, to ship. Uh, I just need this. All right, rendezvous point. Oh, I need all of them, huh? Discover creatures, gotcha. Can I buy for a few nanites? Planetary chart. To what? 
another ancient ruined site, unfortunately. Helping here? No, of course not. Nice, got one. Okay, we're gonna be here a little bit. So thinking. Supreme, oh my gosh. I have some rewards for me, huh? Nice. Ooh, already enjoying this. Oh, a Supreme Scanner, that is great. Whoa. That's huge. Trade Rocket. Oh, Hazard Protection, big time, good. Especially in this planet. Thermic layer. Am I missing anything here? Storm crystals. Hmm. Space anomaly, finally. Nothing yet, huh? Oh, damn. It's a, actually a complete all faces, huh? Hmm. is working so far. Do I have any other business in this planet? I don't think so. I should just expand my inventory and going to trade go to trade stations yeah that's what I should do make more space here make more space here so I'm already gonna need it and this multi-tool I, I, I sh would say it's good enough to be honest it's definitely good enough whoa it did not there we go. All right, this is gonna be very interesting. I would say I'm already stacked in the basic resources. So building, constructing, and making more 
progress from here should be very easy. I have some tritium, but I still need to mine. Whenever I find an asteroid field, I'm definitely gonna stay there for a little bit. Good. Fantastic, fantastic. As you can see, I'm already flexing my status by having broken one of the barriers in the game. Just one of them. But right now, I need to make a base, like immediately. But before, just this one. I must say. Uh, nice. Sure. Good. And now to go away. I'm still lagging in these places. I don't know since the Echoes update this this has been unstable. What do you have here for me? Ferrite dust. I can't go without buying that. Nice. Uranium. Gonna come in very handy soon. Pocnium, why not? I'm already feeling stacked. Then, previous system. Good. Good, good, good. Fantastic, I'm back. Now let's take a look at this again. Uh, malplating, wiring loom, parrot. Never gonna need parrot. Never gonna need copper. No mining for me. Fantastic, I don't need to mine for bullshit anymore. I f it feels, let me tell you, this, this, this right now. Oh, I, this, I'm feeling good good about this let me tell you oh I'm feeling good after doing that magnetized sure why not good now to do some expansions because I forgot to do them in the previous one build a base Alright, expansion number one. Yeah, sure, just make it bigger. Make it bigger. Nice. And now you. Whoa, that is not what I wanted to do. Alright, move me. Upgrade starship. Apply augmentation. And let's put it right here. Nice. And we move. There we go. This is the place. Aha! Magnificent. Now this should be a piece of cake. Chromatic metal. Well, goddamn. 
You got me there, game. I don't have chromatic metal. But I have copper. Good. In the meantime, let me get a little bit of this and a little bit of that. So, how long has the stream been today? Let me see. I'm assuming I'm still streaming, right? Ah. Two hours. It took me long, but on every single other of my playthroughs, I've taken way longer for a decent multi-tool and for a decent ship, especially an A-class. So in terms of gaining status, this has been my best run so far. 17k, not bad. Not to mention that I already have a storage of the major necessary elements here, except Paref. Still missing a little bit of Paref, I would say. But it doesn't matter, like, look, I'm feeling absolutely happy about this so far. And soon enough, I'll be at a pirate system. Gaining some stuff. Gaining even more status, I should say. Okay, I think I should have enough of everything now. Now time to get some more Radiant Shards. And you never know when a little hydrogen is gonna come in handy, let me tell you. Good. Oh, another radiant shard, yes, please. Nice. Scan the flora. Good. Oh, and Atlantidium will come in handy, let me tell you. Just in due time. Due time, good sir. Go due time. Specific gravity? That's an interesting concept. Oh man, is it not good to be back to playing this game as well? Of course it is. I gotta say, um, so far I don't understand the Wet Sky Expeditions, unfortunately. I thought there was gonna be some sort of mission lore, but so far it seems that the point is to just go from planet to planet. In a certain, well, I wouldn't say order, but go from planet to planet finding specific animals, resources, I guess. But you know me, I couldn't resist to get a sentinel ship. A class. Haha! <laughs> Great, so sent this to me. And now let's create a base here. Let's claim this place. Claim site. Good, and now let's rename it. Um, wait, what is that? Is there a harmonic site like right up there too? Did I see that? Is there one right over there? Come on, that's hilarious. Um. Hello? 
Uh, harmonic. Service space. Good. And now. Oh, I can't. No, it's in categories. It's right here. I need to buy the base. Um, I definitely need to buy the teleporter for my base. Because this is going to be my main source of economy for the moment. This is what I'm going to use to... Um, Oops, I didn't mean to put that one there. To generate money and resources whenever I need. Oh, that looks nice. Man, I still need to unlock all of these on my 100% playthrough. Uh, where is the ceiling? I don't see a ceiling. Roofing. Round. Good, 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 good. Let's just make a crappy base. We should be fine. There we go, just a square. Let's put this here. Oh no, it consumes power. Uh, no teleporter too, I forgot. Hold on. Uh, see? Put this thing inside. No, not the panel, good sir. Not the panel. The computer. There we go. Uh, upload base. Good. So now people can come in here if, if they want this. Okay, now... Um, Let's locate another dissonance spike. This is a ship for sale. And with this ship for sale and a little bit more, um, what's its name? Not resources, uh, radiant charts. Between that and some radiant charts, I should be set. Uh, I, I lost my ship. Oh, there it is. But was there another harmonic uh, camp here? Like, seriously. No kidding. I thought I saw one. No. It's not a harmonic camp. It's just, it's just a place. Uh, sure, let's see what it has to offer. Oh, yeah, and another one of these. Good stuff. You know, you really need to pay attention to your surroundings. It'll get you a lot of good stuff over the... Over runs and runs. Nanites here, nanites there. Hello, thank you. There we go. Standing with Gek. Okay. Yeah, I turned off multiplayer because I was getting sabotaged. I don't know who was doing what, but he was causing everybody to lose standing with Gek. And to gain it with pirates. And I was like, what? So, I uh, took the executive decision of deactivating that. Alright, broker. What do you got for me? Uh, uh, here, here you go. Basium. And Gek standing. Storm. Gravitational storm. This planet's pretty safe. Uh, um. So it's just the 212. 
Oh, what the heck is that? Oh. Ruins. Is this Atlantium? Yeah. Unfortunate. Is this uh, crystal? Radiant, yes. Those I need. Holy shit, the gravity. I was not expecting that far of a jump. Okay, now to search for that guy. No, it's too far. It's actually, the guy's actually too far. So we'll go back to the ship. Then we will go get our other sentinel ship. Then we'll sell that other ship and we'll put the equipment back in this one. So it's a little bit of a circular process, mind you, but it does have a lot of rewards. Like, a, like seriously, it has so many. I much rather do this on a... Uh, what's that system name? I much rather do it on a system with oh Corvax instead of in a system with Gek. It's better rewards, but this system is good enough. The only reason why I stayed here instead of moved on is because I didn't have a warp drive, and making a warp drive was gonna cost two fifty a copper. And I was like, no shot, I'm getting 250 copper, you know. I'm, I'm gonna have to spend too much time mining, too much time anything. And instead I decided, well, how about I get a sentinel ship. We rocked that baby. And we made a lot of money while at it. And the plan is working so far. I mean, real question is, how am I gonna get back to my ship, you know? I mean, to my base. Oh, another A-class? Holy crap. That's actually, that's actually incredible. I was not expecting another A-class. And we have an exosuit fragment. So, we are also powering up the exosuit. Look at this. Ooh, solar panel? Wow, this is starting to look like high quality, let me tell you. Very high quality. And more walker brains, so I guess I'm gonna sell those. Oh yeah, I need to get a radiant chart. I mean an inverted mirror. Should be easy enough. Oh, and I need to, I should make more ammunition. Yeah, there we go. Um, we have nothing he else here. Yeah, pretty much nothing else. What difficulty is this on? They are dying so easily. Right, time to get the heck out of there. Good, 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 good. Simple stuff. Good stuff, simple stuff. I don't see any more radiant shards. Fine. Now with this, I should be able to get to the next station. No problem. Which also gives me some words. And who knows what that could benefit me in. Also, the ship is very pretty, you know. 
And it's extremely energy efficient, if I do say so myself. Wait. Oh yeah, it sent me right here. It's right, it's literally just right here. Then I need, I'll go to sell this, then I'll go to space to buy a teleporter for my base, I guess. So I can come and go as I please. Good. Nice, nice. Words here, words there, words everywhere. Percent brain, good. Nice. I can't believe two ships in a row A-class? That's sick. To be honest, if I had happened to find an S-class here, I'd be like, no shot. I can't get that one in my main account by grinding. But in here, in the first two hours, I just find an S-class. That would be crazy, man. Absolutely crazy. Unfortunate, but crazy. Why unfortunate? Well, this is pretty simple. Because I'm not keeping the save. I need to complete 100%. And part of 100% is getting everything that's available to me. Is this ship better than my current one? Uh, in hyperdrive range, but everything else is a little worse. Yeah, sure. I'll claim the ship. Then let's take this other one. Should I take anything off? I th think I should store this. I can store sentinel cannons? I can put sentinel cannons on non-sentinel ships? That's a thing? Interesting. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, I mean, I, I could package it. It doesn't necessarily mean that I can do it, but... I might, right? I might. Alright, good. How many Radiant Shards do I have? I have 11. 11 goes a long way, but it's... I'll be comfortable with 25 should be good enough for me. I'm not planning to engage in too many ship fights. So 25 should be it. Like it should be the right number. I feel also I feel like Quicksilver should be like the the total earned amount should be shared between saves. Since such is such a hard currency to get. Oh yeah, it's, this is right here. Uh, claim ship. Claim ship. Great. And I'm fucking rich. It didn't give me the units. What? It actually didn't give me the units? What the fuck is that bullshit? Oh no... I mean, I got the, these... Oh no, here it is. Oh boy. Yeah, okay. I was I was about to get very pissed. The scrap is the one that's worth. Okay, gotcha. Alright, let's get out of here before it ca crashes my game. Alright, pulse engine module. Shield module. Big important. Big important hyperdrive module. Where's my hyperdrive? Right here? No, this is the anti gravity well. 
Where is... Oh, yeah. There we go. No, you should be here. You should be there. You come here. And you go there. There we go. Wait, what? This is also a dissonance planet? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. This is the exact same planet. What am I talking about? Alright. I think... We should be good with that. A little bit of rockets will we'll go a f long way. Good, good, good. No, well, this serves as also as a tutorial. Uh, and also for anybody that's out there and who's planning on starting the expedition, um, you know. My base is, like, right here. <laughs> and I'll make a teleporter, so if you manage to find it, you got yourself easy harmonic stuff. How many times am I gonna do this? Like, uh, maybe this is the last time. I don't want to... Ooh, let's farm the shit out of this. Even though, you have to admit, this farm is extremely efficient. Like, extremely efficient. It's like what? Between... And depending on certain results, it can be faster, by the way. Like, if I get a, a, a little pack of inverted mirrors, we are set for a while. But it's like, what, 10 minutes for... Low requirements, minimum 10 million profit, plus articles that can give you nanites. Like it, and you get three words. Like you get three words for the... Every time you try to do this quest because you need to go to the alien structure and the alien structure says here's A, B, and C. I, I mean it has the little tiny monolith. The big monolith has the three little monoliths that give you words. You know what I mean. Not to mention farming here, out of all planets, is an extremely peaceful planet. It's like ideal for me, since I love sentinel ships. And I, I tend to stick around a lot on my first planet, like a lot. Good. A lot of Atlantidium, speaking of lots of stuff. And a good, a healthy amount of Radiant Shards. Good. Now... Another material. Good. Now we have this. Uh, more Walker Brains. Trash. Unfortunate. Alright, got a little dihydrogen. Well, also, oh, it's just a B class, but I'm getting Pugnium. And I'm getting a little bit of. Ooh, Machno Gold. That's a lot of gold, by the way. There it is. Alright, so. Hmm. I can start, I can jumpstart a nanite farm, but I don't need too many nanites. I just need invisibility. Ooh, what is this? Hello. This is exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, right by one of these, huh? Good stuff. There it is. 
and more crystals. God damn. You know, this is the beauty about No Man's Sky when compared to Starfield. You're walking around, and as empty as the world might feel, like, you have everything. You walk three steps, and it's filled with resources, it's filled with creatures, with grass, with lush environment that you can interact with. It's not as one random rock here and there. You might call this a more advanced mi Minecraft, if, if you will. And every resource you mine will come in handy at some point in the game. Alright, here is that. Especially for me, like, these crystals, like, for sure it's coming handy. It's coming handy right now, let me tell you. Alright, tritium. No, I don't want to spend tritium on you. An echo locator, huh? Three stars already. You guys came angry today. Nice. One, two, three. where that is go 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 oof oh shit that hurt a lot nineteen eighteen go 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 good 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 an easy escape Unfortunately, I haven't gotten enough mirrors, and without a vehicle, I can't escape or move too fast. But that, ladies and gentlemen, is fine. Let's just go with a nice and relaxed outcome here of success. We assaulted Sentinels, and we got an Echo Locator of all things, which is very convenient. Uh, what am I missing? I guess you summon vehicles. Yeah, I don't have any. Makes sense. Um, I know where to find some. Pognium goes in here, and tritium goes in there. And meanwhile, we search for this. Did I get any shards? No shards, huh? That's interesting. In its own right. I almost have enough. I meant sentinel shards. I have enough radiant shards. I was looking for sentinel shards in my inventory. Wanna go too far. I just need one radiant shard right now. Radi inverted mirror. One inverted mirror right now. Hmm. 
None are spawning, that's what I will say. There we go. Easy. Landing is clear, please acknowledge, please acknowledge, pay attention game. It's very clear as you can see, clear as day. Okay, so now I hope I don't get another echo locator. Oh look, one of these, why not grab it? Nice, there we go. Oh yeah, these assholes. The planet is better off without you. Good. And we just back it up and we're set. One, zero. Nice. Please move, please move. Acknowledge, please move. There we go. Easy every time. Oof. You know, unlike Starfield, No Man's Sky is a chill game. All your goals are accomplished passively. Even when you're in a fight, like, it's very emphatic. There's nothing else to do. You need to have a fight for X, Y, or C, but you just need to be on the fight and you're set. Just focus on it. Every other thing in the game is just passive. Even if you want to focus on something, you, it might not be readily available. Even within your own purpose. That's just the type of game this is. Oh, I forgot to. To click. No, wasted gas. Uh, at this point, I'm just used uh, to being stacked with radiant, I mean with inverted mirrors and I just... I used to come at these and then leave immediately. Alright, that's fine. More wasted gas, unfortunately, but that's fine. I don't think we're gonna need more than 24 radiant shards in the whole expedition. Oh wow. One hour away, it's just in the same direction, but it's not close to each other. Ouchie. Just trim the lower the base of the ship a little. Right, and move here. The seamless experience is just also I miss every time I play Starfield. Just being able to land wherever you want. Like the planet, literally in this game, the planet is yours, man. It's yours. From the moment you step in it. It's already yours. In Starfield, you have to make so much stuff just to get a piece of the world. But here, everything that you see is yours, man. Everything is yours to claim. That's what's beautiful about this. It's just such a great experience, you know? And whereas you don't have the same degree of control like in Minecraft, I just... This is just perfect. This degree of control is just good enough for you not to get anxious. Ah, so nice. Because to, for me, to be honest, when there are too many options, I just... Whoa, is that 200 condensed carbon? Holy crap. Difference... Difficulty does make a big difference in this game. Holy crap, it makes a big difference. Whoa.
I mean, even if you wanted in this game an A class anything, you can't just research it online. You also need to figure out how the heck are you gonna get there. And if you're at the point of the game where you have portals, you don't really need that. Unless you're looking for something like extremely specific, you don't really need it. Because by that point of the game, you just have so much stuff. I mean, to be honest, even, even setting up successfully a single farm just gives you enough resources for anything and everything. Alright, let's claim the ship again. This is a B class, that's fine. Good. Now selling the ship, then... Then we go to the Nexus. And in the Nexus, we research teleporters. And once we have teleporters, we are free to do as we may, literally. Because I can teleport back in there whenever I need another Sentinel ship to sell. Uh, one, oh. Platinum. Counterfeit circuits, huh? Good. Well, my neck is getting tired. I'm probably gonna take a rest soon. Yeah. I know I usually stream for hours and hours and hours. And I might stream later on Starfield, but maybe not. Maybe I'll, I'll just go to sleep because I'm very tired. Oh, it's actually the other side. Gotta say, I don't enjoy being a geck. Stubby, short legs. Greedy attitude. History of violence and deprivation of other species. Hmm, yeah, I don't like being a geck. Alright. Claim it. Good, we have this. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's actually here. I was right, I was right the first time. Okay, um... Starship AI evolves and compressed indium scraps, subatomic regulators. Good. And now, a little bit of this. need more inventory space since I don't have a limit I'll just sell these for 500k I need to cook the magno gold to get more gold Great, 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 great. I still haven't been able to buy Paris. That's important to note. Hello, Nexus. It's a little bit sad seeing you all lonely here. But hey, it's okay. Alright, everybody's here. Hello, boys. Good to see you again. No, I need 
need some of these. Good. And where's the teleporter? Here we go. Do I need anything else? Landing pad could be useful. Saves stuff at the end, but I don't think I need it. Ah, sure, why not? Oxygen harvester, I don't think I'm gonna need it. Medium refiner, I don't think I'm gonna need it. What else can I get? Oh, a roamer. That's actually not a half bad idea. And I can afford both, good. Fantastic, I have a roamer now. Now for cheap, what do I what else do I want? What else do I want? Anything else I can... Electrical wiring. Biofuel reactor, oh my gosh. Proximity switch. Oh boy. No battery, that's fine. Shouldn't be an issue. Okay, good. I got exactly what I needed. Nanites, I have a thousand five hundred nanites. Uh, let's see if I can get some more nanites. I'm gonna need cloaking for my multi-tool and wait there's one that actually gives you cloaking isn't there the card of base parts yeah thanks just what i fucking needed like why i mean as a side reward okay i guess Okay, this one's set. Wonder projector. And to get a wonder projector, I need... Nothing, 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 nothing. Huh. Portal glyph set. Whoa. Tunnel underground? What the heck? Viking words. Oh, I need to go to a red sun. Okay, I need to run. Uh, no, no, I'm never giving you Gravitino Battles. Thank you for fucking judging me, asshole. I really don't like his attitude. Do, but do you understand? Well, it is not for me to judge. It's like, well, then why do you even say it? Just shut up. Rude. Judgmental. Cloaking device. Good. Uh. Good. I think that's all I need. I don't need the ricochet module like at all. Everything else, the difficulty's too low for me to care about anything else. Um, this, this, this just is a quality of life upgrade to be honest. Oh, I need one more iron battery. Hold on, one thing at a time. Thing one, more attack. Thing two. A better scanner. 
Thing three. Uh, thing three, cloaking. Two ion batteries, gotcha. Product two. Good. Now I can go invisible. Okay, now I need Starship Research. Research Starship Upgrades. Colored Drives. Good. Colored Drives uh, Obtained. Launch cost efficiency. Super launch cost efficiency. Save the rest of the nanites? No, I could use an economy scanner. Save the rest of the nanites times two, think. No. I need that too. Good. Alright. Polo and Nata, do you guys have anything to say for yourselves in this expedition? Nothing. Okay. Huh. Hmm. No, 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 sir. Ah, feels good to be invisible again. There we go. One. Another shield module. Two. Pulse engine module. Oh, which one is for the pulse engine? Three, then you, a little bit of you, and a little bit of you, and I'll eventually be able to get the rest, but this should be good enough for the moment. It's enough attack to keep me alive, enough shields to keep me alive on this difficulty. Now time to get back to home base and build a teleporter. From the teleporter, today we will be traveling to... As many places as we can, I guess? Where is my... Oh yeah, it should be right here, around here somewhere. Ah, there it is. Are you pointing at the right one? Yes, you are. Good! Fantastic! Feeling good! Feeling good! So what do we have? We have sentinel shots, we have rockets, and we have a face beam. Which essentially means we are predisposed to survive. Fairly most of the time. And I still need to excavate for some reason. Like big time excavation. That's fine, I guess. So now. Um, CC. Delete this. Move this. Uh, create a door. Then create a landing pad. Oh, two. two batteries god damn it that is actually not it
beautiful. I'll just leave it there for the minute, for a hot minute. Oh, but the ship is not facing in the right direction. Uh, what's rotate? That should be facing in the right direction. Carbon nanotubes too. Okay, let's make two carbon nanotubes then. Fantastic. And now let's just make a reactor. And let's connect A to B. And let's put uh, like one. So that's gonna be up for two hours, okay. Fantastic. So, um, what's next? I... So let me just get some silicate powder for the moment. Uh... Letting this nastiness. There we go. Is this changing the dig objective? That's a great question. It could be, but not necessarily. Huh. There we go. Fantastic. Now, did that change the dig objective? No. Tunnel underground. What does that mean? Oh, tunnel well underground. Okay. Uh... Is this changing the objective? Yes, it is. Why am I required to do this? That's a fantastic question I definitely cannot answer. But hey, at least I can get some progress. Well, I think a little, right? Hmm. Oh, I I was not expecting to get that this quick. I was just zenning out. I was just thinking, hey, um, I'm having fun while digging. Fantastic. Well, what what does it give me? A glyph set. No fucking way! That's what gives me the 16 glyphs? And 17 salvage data? That's crazy! <laughs> That's actually crazy! What the heck? Just unpin this. Okay, expedition. Why is it named Fear the Sun? Hostility quotient. Grow and harvest, farm the plants. Enter a black hole, huh? Okay. So much friggin' module. This is what I need. But where do I find 
something to get a black hole. Polo and Nada can tell me where's a black hole. High paradise rating. So that's the next step. Find the black hole. Good. Should be easy enough. All right, for the moment, I have 21. It's fine. It's actually fine. All right, what do I need to install this tritium? And what do I need to install this? Solar mirror and antimatter. Those are viable. Huh, look, a rock. Tritium, a little bit of tritium here and there. Oh, gold, as a matter of fact. Hmm. Now go to a black hole and take the trip. That's the next step. And after that, get the frigate scanner module. And with it, just call frigates and new systems to discover them quickly. Easy. Oh, that's not the one. I need to talk to this fat boy over here. Hello, Specialist Polo. Can you get me the black hole coordinates? Thank you. And now, change multi-tool to the to this multi-tool. Huh. Scanner, mining beam, and that's it, good. Easy. Now, where's my ship? Oh, there it is. Okay, we're doing great so far. We had a decent ship. So we have kept our essence through the changing of realities and of avatars. All right, sent me elsewhere, buddy boy. Where is it? 
Nice. Very, very close. Water system with Viking. Huh, that poses an opportunity for me. I could learn some Viking words here, but let's just focus for the moment. Strongest reality distortion, nice. Black hole, we here we go. Nice. Woo, my ship looks good. What's the par what's the paradise world? Flourishing. I don't see the one that says paradise. I really don't. Um wonders planet Well, I guess I have this one. But didn't that complete anything for the expedition? I thought there was a... Oh, yeah, there we go. Interesting that it got me here. Oh, yeah, because every player that takes that actually is brought here. To this exact location kind of cool to think about and here we go salvage frigate module some cargo bolt heads as well oh well we are doing fantastic now and then just get into this station and fly right back where we came from so that we can go to the third expedition point I forgot this is laggy as shit. But first, of course, a little bit more space wouldn't kill me. And I'm still missing the basic creature one. Yeah, not gonna waste my time. Those will come in due time. This is Viking space. Why are there so many? Is this Korvax space? Oh yeah, Viking space was the last one. Kill five sentinels. Kill three sentinels. I don't think I need Korvax words. And even then, space station, this one. Good, we're heading back. And after heading back, we're gonna do the third and fourth part of the expedition. Should be simple enough. Easy, easy, easy. Alright, do bear in mind, stream has like um, between 10 and 30 minutes left. I need a rest soon. Alright, great. Now, expedition, second rendezvous point. Good. Back. Navigation, okay, 
How come I got another black hole? Current mission. Uh, free luck. Enter current mission again. There we go. Easy. Curious. I haven't found any unique dialogue options. I'm still waiting for that. I thought those were gonna come and go easily, you know. But I don't see any of it. Alright. So, uh, first of all, we go to the space station. Now, it does sound tedious going to the space station every goddamn time but let me tell you this is gonna pay off at the end one is gonna give me an extra inventory slot two I'm gonna get to check the shop that is key and I repeat key to check the shop why because the shops have the ability of giving me resources without me investing 90 minutes trying to find a planet that has it and staying there long enough to mine it and without that hassle i'm better off so i have i am trading a hassle for more inventory space now granted granted to do this loop you need money usually all of the game breaking loops or cycle breaking loops in no man's sky require you to invest a lot of money but as you can see three hours into the game 75 million yeah. Uh, it's not 500,000, which I... I mean, it's not 500 million, which I could have. But it's good enough. Like, imagine just a player that just gets here and does these missions in hopes of... Uh, <laughs> like, no, man. In hopes of, like, gaining anything. Like, bro, you're gonna invest, like... 20 minutes or more in this quest is gonna give you 149 nanites and you're gonna lose the chromatic metal like bro That that just depresses me Ammonia chromatic metal Ferret dust plasma Like bro this has everything as I was saying, what the frick are you guys doing here? So as you can see, this is serving me very well so far. I have ammonia, pyrit, uranium, without having to spend 90 hours of my life trying to find it. Obviously, I use those sort of numbers. Ooh, asteroid field. So, what can I say, man? Look, my style of gameplay is not based on an ultra-optimized loop where I know the game to, down to the source code and I know exactly which things are spawning where and how to check and how to find something specifically. But you let me tell you something about my game loop. The way I move around trying to maneuver just leads me to find things that I'm gonna need anyway. Without, like, how much time would I have spent looking for one of these? Or, or, or trying to mine measly three asteroids at a time. I could have spent so so freaking long let's just say five minutes how much time did i spent mining finding this and mining 40 asteroids zero seconds finding it and like a minute to getting four asteroids and by the way right now i'm trying to stack on tritium because it's not a resource that you can multiply nor mine so anything that limits alchemy like, I just immediately go for it. 
Now I'm also trying to get an echo locator. Because you never know. I haven't checked every single objective. I don't know if I'm gonna need an anomaly at some point. And now that I'm here, investing little time, like this is still the only way you can get an anomaly detector. I mean, I guess you can use random goods from the pirate station, but bro, with that drop rate, why? Why not just stay here and look at how profitable this is, right? Do you think I'm gonna need tritium for the rest of the run? Like, like no. I'm probably never gonna need tritium again. That's the key part about all of this. Whoa, 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 what are those clouds here? I hear thunders. Wow, I never got an echolocator. That's funny. It's been like 200 of these by this point. Well, at least I'm stacking up in silver and gold, you know. Never gonna need to mine those too. And let me tell you, finding those a bit of a hassle yeah this gives you three types of resources at a time it's kind of nice plus the whole tritium hyper cluster thing right Oh yeah, there's a storm right there, all right. I've never seen one of those. I'll admit. That's sick. to the eye of the storm thundering and roaring well I guess I didn't find an anomaly detector too bad too freaking bad let's process gold nuggets good Process tritium. Nice. Antimatter. Here you go. And now I just need some solar panels. And I have the economy. Oh, yeah, I have the trade outpost. Ooh. But where is the rendezvous to? But where is it? Oh, it's up there. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, I didn't find... I didn't find one of those things, unfortunately. But I have enough of a thing or two in my defense. Which is fantastic. I'm feeling good. I got all I need to continue smoothly to the rest of the run. Goes to show why it's so important not to rush with objectives. And not to rush trying to find small early game loops. What you need very directly is to think carefully 
about what's the quickest way to gain enough status. And that is, of course, through ships salvaging. Like, even, even if you want to just nanites, ship salvaging has options for that too. It's just a good activity to do. Rendezvous too. Oh, what's this? Oh, a tiny little uh, non-trade outpost. It's just a, like a shop machine and that's it. Kinda shameful. Alright, buy ferrite dust, thank you. Um, who knows, maybe that will come in handy. And I think I need 10 of these. One thousand in that direction? No, sir. No, sir. I'm not gonna do that. It's a bit too far for me. Ow. Please. This is a moment to summon my creature. A low pet. Let us go. Why? Why, hello games? There's plenty of room at the back. Why do I have to write write him at the neck? Is it really faster than me? I don't think it's faster than me. God damn it. You have failed me, beast. Well, I still need to scan these. Why do you run so fast when I'm not... Oh, that's the place, huh? You know what? I'm, I'm just sending you away. I can't believe you'd do that. Why do you run so fast when I don't need you to run fast? That is so fucking rude. Like, seriously. It's probably the place, yeah. A little bit of Pugnium, why not? There we go. And also, why are these places the landing spots? Why are these rendezvous points? Does it want me to try to gain a glimpse of the story through talking to those? It could be what it wanted me to do. It's not what it told me. Right, more ferrite, solar mirrors. Let's just buy 10. Navigational data. All right, let's be rich. I'm rich. Actually, I'm buying all of these. Copper, all of it. Dioxide, big time. Big win. Big win for the dioxide. All right, I'm guessing you want me to talk to you, right? Give. Okay, the crypt. Famous Gek Farmer. Yields for spawning pools. If we fail, the children are dead.
Ooh. Oh boy, no sense, none at all. Huh, Atlas and Silly Corvax. The water is the key. Oh boy. What? So he learned to use water? All right, I'm not gonna judge him. Oh, sorry to range. Good. Uh, purchase components. Hydraulic wing, that might come in handy later. Two, two. Uh, I think that's it. Sell. Sure. Ooh. Oh, buy anomaly. Can I? Okay, bye. I guess. A million more here. A million more there. Actually, sell then. Once useful springs, goodbye. Hmm, planetary chart, no longer needed. Handful of cogs. Where is the thing? There we go. Nice. Great. Good stuff. Goodbye, sirs. Good, good. All right, next set of the expeditions. Oh, um, multi-tool expansion slot, inventory slot three. Uh, one, two, three. And now, did I unlock any of this? That's not, not a, any of this. Not any of this, no, no. Yes, destroy 40 asteroids. Emergency signal scanner, oh, Supreme Pulse Engine. Holy crap. Supreme Pulse Engine, no way. You get scrapped and you get scrapped. Anti-gravity well. You can go here, you can go here, you can go here. And use self-region, good. Valuable cargo. Uh-oh. Three? Stop it! Get him! Get him! Good. Damn, they move a lot. Finally. Aha, no escape for you, sir. Good, 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 good. Get him, get him.
Oh, that had to hurt. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff, let me tell ya. Now... Expedition, that one's there. That's a lot of... Emergency signal scanner. Corvex words, nanites, halfway there. Exotic creatures, this one's gonna be a little tough. Alright, got a lot done today. Oh yeah, um, next one, you. Because this one... Yeah, this one, no. I'll try to just stick to systems that this thing sends me to. Go nowhere else. Nowhere else. That way I can record... Um... The trading stations. Uh. Ah. Funny. It's not far enough. Woo! Viva la Sentinel ships. God damn, 800 light years. I can't believe the shitty experience of not picking this up. All right, good. Took one. And then we go to the trading station because it's extremely important. Whoa, now the pulse engine has some efficiency, bro. Oh, seriously, it has some blood planet. Uh, that makes me feel uneasy. What do you mean, blood planet? What are you saying? It sounds damn dangerous, let me tell you. All right. All right, hold on a second, good sir. Where is the rendezvous point? This is a portal, holy shit. What? Please, don't, don't, don't reverse. There we go. Oh, this was the third point. Condensed, nitrate. Um, ionized cobalt, cadmium, oxygen, nitrate, cadmium, ionized. Where did I get this? Because you can't buy that, as far as I recall. All right. Activate portal. Bam. Oh, what? What do you mean it's corrupted? 
What do you mean the location's corrupted? Ooh! Now you're piquing my interest, good sir. Now you're piquing my interest. Where are you taking me? Come on, let me know. Where are you taking me? Hottest temperature? And almost travel. This is cadmium. I, this means I have infinite cadmium. But I, st I still need some Amaro. That would make me feel se very secure about this. Storage augmentation will come in very handy. Oh yeah, now I have enough. Good. Do I need to be in this planet for any other reason? I don't think I need to. Oh, nanites, inventory slot, expansion, multi-tool, ooh. So that's how you play them. You just go for... You try to catalyze your progress using these. Gotcha. Gotcha. Making sense now. Emeril! <gasps> This means that I have infinite. Now it does mean that I have infinite of these. Great. Good. Good to know. Oh, good stuff. Oh, this is good stuff. All right. All right. So, um... Where am I? Yeah, I need to check what part of the universe I'm at. Whoa, I am. A's and Tom? What the frick am I doing in Ace and Tom? Is, is the expedition is actually an Ace and Tom? Not a Euclid? Okay. I, I dig it, I guess. Expedition. Fourth. Oh no, I'm nowhere near. Oh, yeah, I'm nowhere near. So this to apply upgrades to me. And I need upgrades too to my ship. And that's pretty much it. Good, 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 good. Oh, and I need one more for myself. Fantastic. Growing my own company upgrade ship by augmentation yeah you're gonna need one there one there <laughs> 
Get set. Then I'm gonna need more for me. Good, good, good. And equip the navigation data. Nice. Our economy loop is set up. Our strength loop is set up. Everything's set up now. We're ready. All right, exosuit navigation. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Ferrite dust. Uh, uranium. Phosphorus. Beautiful. Ammonia. Come on, man. Good stuff. Then plus 3.4%. I just made 4 million. God damn, I'm making some money. And then go back to just the previous system. Good. So going back to this system will allow us to progress further. By going the way of the expedition, I guess. Uh, more ferrite dust, cobalt, dioxide, uranium, phosphorus, and let's pick up some salt, why not? Magnetized ferrite. Woo, we got it all, baby. We are rich. We're rich. We're rich. As the good old dwarves would say, besides rock and stone, that is. Good. Now, current mission. Expedition. Where is the thing? I don't see it. Am I in the wrong place? No, here's my ship. So... How many jumps am I gonna have to make? It seems to be in an implied direction, but the game just refuses to tell me what star I need to go to. getting out of here.
Huh. There you are. Curious. It's a bit farther than I thought, but I'm in the right section now. Great. Great, 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 great. And a little bit of tritium, why not? My ship is looking amazing already. Oh, I forgot to use this. Well, in due time, I will. Due time. You're pointing at the wrong one, sir. And this ship is very maneuverable. 1,208 maneuverability? What the fuck? Those numbers, I've never had numbers that high for maneuverability. What does it mean? Does it mean I can turn fast? It certainly doesn't. Does it mean I can go faster than normal? I see normal speeds. I think I need to figure out what the heck that means. Uh, do we have, like, any site around here? I don't see anything here. There's a little hut there. There we go. An animal here, an animal there. Good. And the rock here are two. Nice. Seems to be that way. And it says a thousand in this direction, roughly. All right, am I better? Worse? It seems it's right there on the crash station. 81, whoa, I have some fuel efficiency, brother. And landing on these, even better, even easier for me. Chimichanga, what's good? And woohoo, baby. That's not what it says, obviously. Lack of echo. Wait, log. Life goes on, go home. Sentinel energy signature, dropping out of warp. Fighting each other. In if I, Sentinels fighting each other? Distress signal, 16. I'll go take a look, interesting. Uh, thank you, but no thank you. I have no need for that loot. You 
You don't say what's good. That's like so 1940s. You should say what's poppin', bro. Uh, also, please remove, uh, not that one, not that one. Oh, it's not even here. Okay. Voyagers, some nanites, inventory, multi-tool, expansion, nice, nice, nice. I have enough space. I just can't imagine. Wow, you really do need a lot of experience in the game just to follow through with these objectives. I mean, I guess if you don't, it's not necessary, you know? Like, it's truly not necessary to have it. Actually, expeditions make the game easier. Like, far easier, but at the same time... I'm just thinking... I mean, if you kept the shitty ship, how many hours until you run into a good one? If you don't do the Sentinel money loop, how do you get money early game? Now I'm pretty much self-sustaining. Look, 80 million units. Just buying and selling whenever I find... Uh, Navigational data. Like that. <laughs> what do we have here, good sir? Very dust, always good. Uh, let's buy 15 of these. You never know when those are going to come in handy. Paraf. And let's just stack on these and the mission or two why not hello sir useless you're useless to me nothing to sell there Got, gotta expand my inventory slots these are some cool colored chips man Oh yeah, the system's got some cool color chips. Oh yeah, you need storage augmentation, so upgrade, apply, and you're gonna need this here. Good. Then I need another one of these. Uh, I'm gonna need it here, I guess. Then apply these over here. Install slot. Nice. And now the last station. Oh wait, do I actually need to activate the teleporter to get registered here? Maybe I do. I'm just gonna... Activate it to know. I mean to be sure. There we go. Now I can move on. Good. Now, for our last objective. Okay, doing well on those. Doing well on those. Hmm. Blue star missing. Earn 200,000 for a discovering a creature. That's gonna be hard to get. Oh crap, that's gonna be hard to get. I'm gonna need. A lot of visor mods for that. What a treasure?
Why are there so many safe beacons here? L shape supercharged staff workshop. What? Expedition one outpost four. What? Hold on. What was that underground or treasure thing? I thought I saw something like that. Ah, underwater ruin. Okay. Well, we'll get there when we get there then. Now, we reach the final rendezvous point. Okay. Easy. No blue stars? Huh. I thought they would include blue stars as part of the main one, but it seems they were all yellow. Easy, nice. I mean, I guess they're pretty far. You're not like with a ship with 200 range and low fuel efficiency, you'd take a long time, let me tell you, to jump this far. Bountiful moon, huh? Oh, curious. The moon is a bountiful one. Activated copper. That means, and I have antifreeze. So I could, in fact, go there to get my electric crystals. Which is an interesting concept. Four, three, two, one. I don't see anything. There's nothing. Oh, actually, there is that. It hadn't spawned, that's different. Great. Nice, I made it. Great. What do we have here? Ferrite dust. Uh, and that's it. Oh, nice. Plants here, plants there. Minerals just in case. the blood thing what the heck is that 
Nice. Okay, how are we doing on inventory space right now? We're doing great. We're doing fantastic. So now... Uh... Actually... And you drive. That's funny. Not enough cadmium, enough chromatic metal. Good. Oof, the ship is running out of space. Quickly, also as well. So in freighter. All right, what else do I need to do before ending? Oh yeah, collect the expedition rewards. So, new reward, naturalist. Powerful scanning system, powerful protection module, nice. Give me the scanner. Oh, uh, this is awkward. No, fauna plus 6,000 percent, but this one doesn't give fauna. Okay, too bad. Actually sent that away, put this here. Great, fantastic. Um, I need to put this here, put this here, put this here maybe. Fauna 8,000. We need to talk about that fauna one, really. Oh yeah, the toxic protection module. Good, good, what else? Oh yeah, something else. There's another expedition reward. So, upgrade exosuit right here. Nice. That's exactly what I was looking for. Huh. I don't have anything for it. I guess I'll put this one here. All right, cool. Nice. So, oh yeah, and jetpack trail. Woo! Nice, fantastic, amazing, absolutely beautiful. We have completed part one. Nothing else to get. Part two. So, yeah, maybe I should get this one. Corrosive blood, holy shit. Oh boy. Hmm. Specialized warp, what the heck is that? Need to get the storm crystals first. Should be easy on that ice world. Supreme hyper drive. Oh. Uh, launch auto charger, like, uh. Easy, but it's gonna take a little to get there. Higher than 60s. Oh. Fire planet. Blue star system. I can actually go to a blue star system.
very close to botanist this is gonna be a problem maybe easy easy and this might be a problem I don't see anything there are two or three that are problematic and some of them are trivial but have a but the prerequisite for the trivial one is difficult that's fine Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna leave it here for now. I'm too tired to continue. I'm thirsty. I need to sleep. It's been fun. Voyager's Expedition. Uh, how am I liking it? Uh, it's like interesting, but you get rewarded for the weirdest stuff. Trivial to a point, I must admit. Uh, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but I haven't found any sort of lore like uh, No, no lore at all so I Just woke up in a ship and that's it. I uh, and I just sort of walk around I guess the voyage voyage theme is discovering different things around the universe Cataloging different worlds um, Sounds good. Maybe it implies that there will be a major exploration update in the future But I cannot think of anything I am so far unimpressed With it, but it does prove indeed an enjoyable experience and it does challenge the player to do a thing or two I'm fine with it absolutely fine as you can see in just a few hours you can complete about 40 percent of it more or less yeah four hours for like the first hard four hours you can complete 40 percent because i really already did the hardest shit which is finding a sustainable way to travel Getting money, finding nanites, establishing a, a, a good set of upgrades. And obviously it had to do with me completing the milestones. But as you see, going from the first rendezvous point to the second one is like a hard ask. Because they want you to go to light speed and to do that. You need you need the upgrade which was not given to you And you need to establish a base which wasn't given to you either. So it's asking sort of hard stuff But after that it's asking for specific things that you may or may not find like this one was free Which is kind of cool. I Wasn't expecting them to just you know give us that but they did and We're better for it I don't see how these are gonna change my inner world, but uh, like nine words? Come on, man. 7,000 nanites, but when you give us all those nanites? Uh, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it. I will be completing this, obviously. Uh, next goal will be bottled lightning, then wondrous projector. Then I don't know. I don't know where to get this this predator. Visit blue star, easy. Visit red star, easy.
This one, this one's a tough. Where the heck am I gonna get glitches and anomalies? That one, complex. And a tall herbivore. Ah, we'll see. Well, thank you all for watching. This has been No Man's Sky, Voyager's Expedition. I'll be ending the stream here. I am just absolutely destroyed today. I had a great time. Tomorrow, we'll see much more of Samara, the star born. And we'll continue 100% No Man's Sky later. I don't know if tomorrow, I don't know if two days from now. But obviously, we have to finish the 100% run because that is what I said I'll do, and I'll do that. As a matter of fact, I find it far freaking more tedious to go through the voyage since it's not contributing to my 100% run than to, well, I guess it's getting the, the Voyager content, but I find it far more tedious than just having continued my run because... Because the same sad reason as, as, as when I in Starfield became Starborn. Because I left everything behind, you know? And it's not even about, oh, you left a conquered world behind. No, no, no. I left a world that I had built. That I had participated in behind. And in this case, in No Man's Sky, the universe is far too big. And the factions are irrelevant. But. My. My ship. My ship with my plants. With my alchemy. With my frigates. My collection. You know. The style I gave it. My fucking outer space bar man. That shit was cool. I went there just because I wanted to. And it wasn't even contributing to the run. But I had a great time just by sitting there. By starting the run there. By going there to think. By adding to it. I just... It's part of me, man. That which I created is also part of me. Even if it exists and it's independent. I just appreciate it. Even if it's a virtual world, I... I did it. I created a little corner of space for myself. I had a great time in it. And perhaps it is a mission of conquering this voyage so I can go back there. To my character. To my ships. To my music, because I did it. And to my outer space bar. I want it back. There are things, there are thoughts, there are just ideas. It is a false environment, but it is the one I made and I find it desirable. Thanks everybody. Have a fantastic day, night, whichever. We will see more of No Man's Sky soon. See ya.